I'm Chad Reynolds with BangShift.com and we're here live at the 2010 SEMA show in Las Vegas. There are tons of killer aftermarket products all over the convention center and we're gonna bring them to you all week long. But right now, we're here at MSD where they've got a couple of big announcements for the ignition world. So come on with me, we're gonna go talk to Todd Ryden and find out all the dirt. Hey Todd, how you doing? Doing good, Chan. How's it going? With good, you? very right. good. There's tons of cool stuff here at SEMA, but I gotta tell you, you guys have a lot of neat stuff here. We always have cool stuff here. This I, is where we bring it out. I know. Well, and I see you got the power grid set up, which is really cool, which is now getting ready to go out on the market with mm -hmm. a ton of cool features. Yep. But the really hot deal is the 6A and 6AL. Yeah, how about that? The 6A, 6AL been out for 25, 30 years, virtually untouched, still performing great, but we're doing some digital upgrades to them for 2011. I mean, you look at it, it looks like an MSD piece. You can tell it's a 6AL. People still want MSD under the hood. They want the, the red, the fins. But what you're getting here is higher output than the current units. Digital control, rev limit is extremely accurate. The real and cool feature, it's a little bit lower, but the nice sealed locking connector, so all your wiring's routed out one side, easily to mount, easy to pull off if you want. And then the rev limiter is built in under this little doohickey here. Flip yeah. that out and you got a couple rotary dials, so no more fumbling around for RPM modules and pills. Really? So now is this unit then programmable as well, or is it is it just a digital version of the 6AL? It's 6A? just a digital version of the 6AL. It, it makes more power using less energy, so it's more efficient due to the electronic circuits and the digital control. Okay. But if you really want programmability, you could add our new power grid controller to it also and open up a whole new window of tuning opportunities. So you guys have really stepped up to where if you've got one MSD ignition system now, you don't need to replace it wholeheartedly. You can add to it, upgrade it as you go along. Yep, we have very modular stuff across the board. You can add accessories, two-step rev controls, multi-step retards for nitrous, and with the new power grid, yeah, you can put it all on your laptop. That's cool. Now one other thing, this looks like it's the same footprint as the old 6AL, is that right? That's exactly right. So if you want to upgrade, take your 6AL off, this bolts right in its place and the harness will hook up your existing wires. Nice, clean, easy upgrade. Wow, that's cool. Okay, and so in traditional guys, they know 6A, no rev limiter. 6AL has rev the rev limiter. limiter. Yep. So that's the difference. So if folks are looking for a new ignition, they don't have to feel sorry that the old 6A and 6AL are going away because they still have a great choice. That's right. This All is right. still out there. It's still the 6AL, still the number one selling performance ignition out there. And when are these going to be available to the public? January 17th. January 17th. So on January 17th, you come to bangshift.com, you click on your MSD ad on the side, say, hey, Todd told us to come get them today, and you can order them right there. That's right. All right. <laughs> One of the cool things that I just realized was, without a little plug-in module, how do you put a two-step on a 6AL? Well, MSD, of course, figured that out. They've got this cool digital two-step module. All it does is wires into the TAC output wire on your 6AL. Boom, instant two-step rev limiter right here. MSD, thinking of everything. One of the most bang shift approved things here at the show, also in the MSD booth, the new power grid system. We're really excited about this. This thing is so new, so crazy awesome. I can't even tell you all the features. You're gonna have to check it out at msdignition.com. But let me tell you one of the biggest things, USB port hooks up to this. No more serial cable needed in order to make adjustments on your ignition system. And this box right here, hooks up to any MSD ignition that you have that is not programmable and makes it completely programmable. It also allows you to data log all your ignition functions, timing curves, all of that stuff, all through a little micro SD card. So you pull it out, put it in your card reader or into your computer, and you can look at all your data logs. It's really neat. The other cool deal about it, it has CAN bus technology, and this is thanks to the uh, whole race pack partnership with MSD. And the race pack guys have built this CAN bus system so that you can stack on modules, like for the slew rate rev limiter control deal that's traction control that's not allowed in pro stock. You can add that if it's allowed in your class. So there's tons of different stuff. This is gonna be the latest in ignitions right here. And as excited as we are about the 6AL and the 6A, which are bitchin' new boxes, this is gonna revolutionize the ignition system world.